Hi, this is Eli Avram and today I'm going to be talking about my beauty and makeup hacks. Ice bath uh, for my face. Um, it's like a bucket uh, filled with water that I put in the freezer uh, for some time and then I remove it sometimes. Uh, in a hurry I just put some ice cubes in it and then I go like zhoop and it really just wakes me up and tightens the skin and makes it feel fresh uh, and then after that of course um, I wash it with a face uh, wash um, and then I put aloe vera gel on and then after that I put my eye cream on uh, which contains a lot of avocado uh, so that's really good um, and then Mm, if it's like a day where I'm going to be wearing a lot of, uh, you know, makeup, uh, then I make sure to put another uh, moisturizer on. Uh, I think that's like the wing liner, but not with an eyeliner. Basically, um, with uh, like a little bit of uh, eyeshadow. Um, and then I use my uh, eyebrow brush because it has that perfect tip, you know. Um, so I use that one and I just do a very natural, in a very natural way, you know, with a dark brown more than black because whenever I used to do black, my eyes just popped up like even more and I wanted to look very natural. So that's something I do and it works so well. Like sometimes you don't even need to put mascara on as well. You know, you can just do that and it just gives that nice look. So basically I remember I had watched uh, Sophia Lawrence uh, and she had that, that cat wing, you know, with that black liner and I was like, gosh, this is so gorgeous. So immediately after watching the movie, it was a black and white movie, I remember, I went inside the bathroom, I uh, picked up my mother's uh, black eyeliner and I did the same thing. Of course, it was super thick and uh, I came out and I showed my parents and I was like, how do I look? Let's say five. I'm at five now because I love it, but then sometimes I'm so annoyed of wearing it because I think I wear it so often, right? Because of shoot and all of that, that suddenly you've started to come into the zone where you're like, I don't want to wear makeup, but I still love it. Like if I go inside a, a what do you say, like a makeup store and I see all those like, you know, glittery sh eyeshadows, beautiful lip colors and all, I'm like, I just want to buy all of them and just have them at home and just once a day, just, you know. So I don't know, is five a good number to say then? Or am I actually a seven maybe? I think seven is a good number, I'm a seven, yeah. Oh my gosh, many. And actually it's not when I have been doing the makeup. It's when uh, some makeup uh, artists have done my makeup initially, not like, initially during my career and like even like back home in Sweden and they just made me look like a Dracula. And I was like, God's sake, like what, why all this makeup and it's look, it's like an excitement when they are like, you know, and a little bit of this and a little bit of this, instead of actually seeing me and maybe all of that doesn't work on my face, you know? So gosh, there have been some disasters. Oh, I remember this one, I ended up looking like a drag queen. No offense to drag queens, but I mean to say, I'm not one, right? So why should I look like one unless I play that as a character? I think uh, that would be um, Ashwarya Rai Bachchan uh, or Alia Bhatt, yeah. Yes, I have, the one uh, that I was a part of actually, <laughs> as in I was the one sitting there and getting it done. That's it actually, otherwise no, but uh, when I was younger, okay, so here's the thing, when uh, there was a time during um, my teenage days where I actually wanted to become a makeup artist and a stylist in Sweden. Um, because since my childhood, I always loved doing makeup. So what I used to do was, um, I used to buy like these magazines and I used to watch the models and I used to see, you know, the makeup. And then I used to try and myself, literally like my Friday nights was, you know, being at home, doing all different kind of makeups and then clicking my pictures and being like, okay, that was nice. Mm, no, no. So that's why a lot of people also who have seen me when I do my makeup myself, they're like, how do you know? I'm like, well, there are years of practice, you know? So uh, yeah, so since my childhood, what uh, my mother used to do is she used to put uh, Greek olive oil uh, in my hair. That's actually very, very good. It's very good for your skin as well 
Uh, I don't know about the Indian climate, but in Sweden, when it's very cold during winter and all, it's very good to put uh, olive oil on your face as well. Apart from that, uh, something that's very good, it's uh, wheat. Um, just to mix it with water, uh, put a little bit honey as well and put that on your skin. Uh, yeah, that's, that's very good. Lemon uh, is also very good to put on your skin for some time. Even aloe vera, actually the real one, you know. Um, just cut it, just put it, um, what do you say, like, yeah, like from where you cut it, um, place it like this on a plate so that all yellow dirt comes out, once it out, then only do you cut it and then put that gel on your face for like 15, 20 minutes. I mean, uh, you only remove it when it's really got like completely dried up. That's also very good. So guys, this was all about my beauty hacks. And uh, if you like this video, then do press like, subscribe and share. <laughs>